Okay, we're up and running. Good to know. Of the Soma, continuing on from where we were. Okay, let's go fire a couple of things in different places. There we go. Ay, 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 ay. Ah, see what I'm doing. There. That's fine. Everything's running nicely. Simon and Catherine have found the Dunbat, but it's been quarantined, so they need to find somebody who would know a security cipher so they can gain access. Only with the Dunbat will they be able to enter the abyss and find the Lost Ark. That sounds familiar. Anyway. Basically, as I recall, uh, I was at the point where we're about to go enter into the downstairs bit where there's some kind of blind creature wandering around. It's all gone full amnesia at this point. So we've had the multi-eyed seeker kind of guy who wanders around with his winky hanging about and makes me go all electrically discharge out if he catches me. But it doesn't kill me, which is nice. I like the way they've gotten around this you can't actually die in the game sort of thing. That Yeah, all that happens is he knocks you unconscious for a little while, which kind of defeats the purpose of why he chases you in the first place. Um, so yeah, it, I think at the point I ended it, we were literally descending into hell um, to try and activate something. My only concern for this stream is... I am expecting an Amazon delivery, and the Amazon deliveries here can come at any point in the day between midday and about six at night, so it could well come right in the middle of the stream, which tends to happen. The phone will probably go. Six million people will arrive, but anyway, here we go. Yes, so we just come down the staircase, and yeah, they just told me, yeah, there is a beastie floating around that has no face. Looks human from a distance, has no face. Why, every time I load this game, does it feel like the mouse sensitivity is dropped? Or is it me that I accidentally cranked it down on this? Oh, I've probably done it on the mouse. I only five button mouses, honestly. What are they all about? Very good. 
this time I don't have to go from there or something. There almost certainly will be something. Yeah. Uh, they can't mantle in this game, so... Probably still hear me wandering around. Probably the problem. This is coming this way. Coming this way. I missed something. I didn't miss anything. This is exactly where I was earlier. This will make a lot of noise. That was good. Hmm. shut that door, he's definitely going to hear me. Do not make it easy. Ah. Ah, right. So I must have gotten lost and there we go. Okay.
Oh crap. Oh no. That's the dead end. Don't be there. Forgetting how the game works. Good, so theoretically that thingy should not be able to do that. Because it doesn't have any hands. That's not good. So invariably something will now have appeared around here. I've played computer games before. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathwork already etched into the base. So, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't used to work like that. Fully sentient machines. Thinking they are people is definitely... But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Stuff like that in games. Emergent terrorizing. Just easily created by that. Right, now I was up here earlier. See, if I made this game, I would get to this point and then all these, all these doors would just da -da 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 open when I got to the other end. Because that would be So, terrible. you're not worried that there are other Simons or Catherines running around out there? Now I am. Gee, Simon, some thoughts are better left alone. Okay, so... This is fine. I wonder what the real Simon would have thought if he knew about me. What do you mean? You do know about yourself. No, I, I mean the real Simon. The human Simon. Going by your reactions, I'd say he'd be pretty upset. Can I use this one already? Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Oh, no, Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Stro. Should be right now. Fix it. I already did that. Please don't tell me that I haven't done it. Really, really irritating if uh, it turns out that I had to wait around there and then press a button. Uh, 
Last time was going around that way. Dude, there's no way you can hear me from here. I'm half the thing you wait and crawling. Come on, what, I had to flip that back then? That is a metric ton of bullshit. Okay. 
double checking on a wee thing there. Good job, Simon. It's better if we're going down there again. I didn't help that. Nakajima Neurography. How did you read? North Englander. Gar Conrad from the north of England. Waterfill steel tank. Scan room. Oh, do not use. Oh, totally. That's going to be what gets used. I think it says do not use. Let's load up that chip. Cool. No. Scan log. Da -da 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 -da. Are these, oh, oh, these are staff, all right. Probably the names of both the game. All right, well, that's not much use to me. I presume I have to now look. I know. That always works, doesn't it? See. I mean, I, I assume Stransky would be the person. Stransky, Stransky. Too much um, uh, cross of iron. Captain Stransky. Great film. And a few good films made by the Americans um, about World War II from the German point of view, because it doesn't treat them all like weird, crazy Nazis. There is like one weird, crazy Nazi in it, and everybody else is basically just. Pissed off Vermac, who just won't go home, or mad Prussians. Uh, it's gonna be this guy, isn't it? Strasky! Oh, Peter Strasky! No, I'm an Englander! Um, it doesn't really tell you much. A construct wrangler, I would think that would be the person. Right? 
Strawheimer <coughs> has tightened security. You know what? It's got. It's going to be Strasky, isn't it? They've battered. They've battered about the name Strasky so often. It's going to be him. No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. How am I supposed to know who Theta Security work on? Doesn't say. I don't want to just do them all because that's just bullshit. Come on, there must <coughs> somewhere in here. There's some kind of information. something <coughs> well guy Conrad's from the state security oh, no. Security people at Kronstadt or Strohmeyer. Hmm? No, I don't think so. Strohmeyer recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher, if you can find one of them. Very promising. I'll just load them up and get the simulator going. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Just keep calm. Dr. Chan? What the hell is this place? I don't have time to explain. I need you to give me the new security cipher. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. It's not for me. I'm trying to save the Ark. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Chan, I'll punch your teeth in! Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up. Bastard. <coughs> what? How did I get here? Don't be afraid, Mr. Wan. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Just be calm. Take a deep breath and enjoy the scenery for a moment. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here! It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. 
It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here! Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So? What's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up. Bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Don't be afraid. Chun? What happened to I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. There's no need to worry. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Okay, calm down, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why, are you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. Use the one your house supposed to use, the Versailles model. Of course. Just reset the simulation. Okay. That's fine. Oh, that's mess with this idiot's head. I would send the poor bugger to the side. So bad. This robot really 
got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did he... Alice? Mr. Wan, can you hear me? Chun? Where's Alice? She had to leave. Listen, I really need to know the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. Please calm down. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! How many times are we gonna have to do this? Come on, Simon, don't give up now. The problem with this is Catherine is an idiot. <sighs> that wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up. Bastard. <laughs> this should what? be a game in itself. Where did it? Alice? Congratulations, Mr. Wan. The scan was successful. Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. Please, this is important. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! This setup won't work. We need something else. Let's go back to the ski. Clearly we need a module. What if we take his... I'm gonna end up having to jump in here. I'm gonna end up having to pop them into a machine, am I? Why would it have the Versailles option? Why? I know exactly where this is leading. I'm gonna end up having to pop him into this beastie here. Data? How am I supposed to use it? Um, Hello, Vicky. How you doing? Hope you haven't been there long. My my glance doesn't actually tend to go across to that side of the screen that often. Um, thanks for joining me on the stream. Um, I'm struggling with this game um, because it's doing my nothing. All right, I need an environment. I need a module. Throw a bit of paper at this guy because he's an Egypt. Right. Yeah. Okay. Let me. Uh, how can I. So how am I supposed to. I need to change this file. I need to change this file. Do not use. Do not use because presumably it's just messed up. So there has to be somewhere else I can attach this to utilize this. I look like your cousin. I 
Uh, I probably do have one of those faces. I used to get told I looked like the guy from the fun little criminal door. Not so much these days. Certainly not with this beard. Sheer perseverance. Torturing. That wasn't so bad. This room might really get me worked up. Bastard. Eventually we'll actually get to what? the point. What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chun? What happened? I, I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wong. It'll all get better. No, no, that, that's a lie. No, You're lying. Lie. Mr. <sighs> Try the scan room again. That wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Mr. Wan, can you hear me? Chun? Where's Alice? She's fine. We don't have much time, Mr. Wan. I need the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. No, it's okay, I promise. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me while you Catherine hear me. Is you terrible won't this. break me! You are literally... Simon, we need something new to work with. We've tried that. I need a module. <sighs> that wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up. Bastard. Give me a hint. What? Where did it... Alice? All the other circuits are fried. The scan is done. Are you feeling all right, Mr. Wan? Chun? Where's Alice? She had to leave. Listen, I really need to know the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. Please, this is important. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me while you hear me. You won't break me! Hint. You can't keep trying the same thing over and over. Clearly not. But we've tried everything else, and you're rubbish at it. So... Can I go over here? Would that do something? No. That's just the gold storage. So, I can't log him in there. God damn these chairs in my way every two seconds. Nothing. Sorry if this is somewhat of a boring stream, it's just literally <clears throat> trying to find my way around this puzzle where virtually no information has been given. thinking too, too close to the bone. Here we go, Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Brandon, your whole family has been eaten by a monster. 
I like the boats. Maybe it's their Possibly his heritage. I don't know, he also likes cat, he just likes buildings and hills. Nasty in his bed. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Strasky and I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, and I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. Heard some lady telling Brandon to hurry up. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. That's Alice Coster. Wouldn't have guessed they even knew of each other. Interesting. They was getting it on. Cute. Damn you, Origami. No. There's a note from Alice that makes me think she was scanned alongside Brandon. Okay, that sounds really promising. We can definitely use that. I think we got this, Simon. I can synthesize sure. Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely so feeling good about like this. Lanes good job with the intercom. The I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. Oh, sorry. I found more evidence suggesting they were together during the scan. That's okay, Sherlock. We got it already. We should focus on simulating Brandon Wan. Okay. Space station I thought we were on at the beginning of the game. That's the point you're supposed to assume it's I compiled an Alice module that we can use. So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. Grandmother's I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. I want to send it to Versailles. That seems like a better option. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Stromar. He said he needed yes, a new cipher so. ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Sean just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. DeLong. Brandon. Goodbye. What do you mean? No, wait. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. Oh, I can't take him with us? Oh, come on. I just wanted to... I was going to put him back. I was going to put him back. No. No. No, 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 no. right. Give me this thing back in. Uh. 
Uh, yes, I uh, I am from from Scotland. Uh, it's one of the ways I actually know JB. Um, we've both been involved in various local kind of games, journalisticy type sites. Oh, never mind. Um, sorry, Mister, whatever your name was. You know what? I'll put you back in cold storage. This place looks safe. I'll just tell me a valid attempt to do so. All right. I was never here. I, don't need that anymore. I feel like a terrible human being now. Okay. That wasn't open before. Simon, we got it. We can get to the Dunvat now. Get back here. Catherine, couldn't we just have extracted the cipher from Brandon's data somehow? It's so cruel bringing him back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Let's just hope it was worth it. Clearly there's going to be somebody there. about the Brandon thing. Even worse than the robot at Delta. It's for a good cause. Oh, it's not. We're saving all of humanity or something. Of course, I've smashed this window, which means I can't lock myself in. Well, that did a lot. There you are. Just warming up the Dunbat for us. Spent collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Okay, that's it. That's everything. Let's go ahead and... Huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. No, what tell do you me. need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now. And get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the Abyss. Um, Sounds easy I, enough. I stream every now and again. I mean, to be honest, it's mainly just because I don't feel in the mood to stream. Uh, I'm getting more into the habit of doing it. I think there was a large portion of it. For a long time, I just didn't because I hadn't set up a webcam. Um, I just got this whole PC set up fairly recently. Um, Yeah, basically, I had a half decent PC, but it was never quite good enough to sort of do this kind of thing. And then I've been, basically, I, I started doing the old Twitch stream on the Xbox without able to save the camera and things like that, because uh, I've got like a capture card or anything and I wasn't that close to doing it. So I would stream just odd bits here and there, and I tried it out. And there's a video, I think, on my, I've got YouTube, and there's a video on my YouTube where I uploaded quite a lot of them. Like one of them was a video that I did in Amnesia Machine Fix. Which was kind of just a test to see if it worked. Because I actually recorded, I completely uh, like used fraps to record the in-game stuff. And I used my uh, my camcorder, which actually has a built-in webcam function, which is quite nice. Um, used that to... <laughs> that would be so good if I had to actually move these stairs. I have to move the stairs! Yay! Little things make me happy. Um, oh, and a box full of stuff for me to throw around and distract someone. Oh, maybe I can't use the stairs because I can't get it.
Gee. I'm gonna have to leave here in a hurry. I've played games before. Yeah, so uh, I that was a fun one because I ended up having to put together the the video and the stream. Luckily, I'd had from the audio. I literally went like clicked my fingers, I think, or clapped or something at the point where I pressed one of the buttons on screen so that I could sync it all together and then had to edit it all together and it was ridiculous because the footage ended up taking up like something like I think the it was an hour and a half stream or an hour long stream or something and it was uh it took up something like four and a half gigs of files just on that stream. So the good thing about that was once I'd uploaded it, I could delete all that stuff and free up all that space. I do like streaming, it's fun. I think a lot of games it's actually more fun. And a lot of stuff you can just put on in the background. The only games I don't like doing it on are stuff like... I once did stream... Uh, oh, what's it called? I think it was Life... I streamed Life is Strange, the very first episode of that. And I ended up unstreaming that because it's such a game with so much reading involved that... I can't imagine it would be any fun for anyone to watch me sitting going, hmm, all the way through it. And that was basically what I was going to have to do. Uh, right, we're plainly not going to be able to get on this at this point, so... I like Life is Strange. It's interesting, but I was also I was playing on the Xbox, so it was literally you wouldn't even have seen me doing it. It was just a case of it was just a case of watching me doing nothing, or not even watching, just listening to me going. Mm -hmm or reading out the stuff, which I don't like doing, so I can reading out every bit of dialogue. I don't like hanging out the streamer. Some people really like that. Okay. We've had that not one. Achievement unlocked, plan B. So here's an interesting one. Um, I don't know how much you, you game, I presume you game quite a lot. Um, but the what's in I always find interesting in these ones. Oh look, and this door shut. So I'm just gonna yeah, we gotta go the other way, which I didn't want to do. I'm the kind of gamer who, if I'm playing a game and I see what looks like the pathway ahead, I go the opposite direction because I've spent too many years playing games where you head down one corridor and you end up um, loading the next section, and there may have been stuff to pick up if you went the other way. Yeah, yeah. through the bottom, like sort of Half-Life style. Been done before. Original Half-Life did that. The only trouble with this game is not with, um, yeah. It, it's a good plan because too many games have done that and then feel robbed of stuff. The problem is a lot of games now do it the other way where it, it lets you do everything before you move on. This is actually, this is interesting, this is one aspect of streaming, I think, unfortunately, that, that I do find causes some problems in some ways, is that the, um, because when you stream, half your attention is on 
what's going on. Well, no, I, yeah, I take I take time and explore things as well. Um, but I think the problem is, oh, what I was saying was the, uh, the the other problem is, especially playing like a horror game, if your attention's half drawn away, it's like watching. I remember talking to a pal of mine about some film. I think it was um, El or El Orfanto, which is a really really good sort of horror movie. Um, which is just really creepy the first time you watch it, and just really sad when you watch it after that because you realise a lot of the stuff that's creepy in it isn't actually that creepy. But um, but it, it's terrifying the first time you watch it. Uh, and there are there are some generally horrible moments, um, uh, just terrifying stuff. But I remember saying to a friend, "Oh my God, you got to watch that! It's so it's so scary." And she got back to me later and she was like, "I didn't find it scary." And I was like, "When? Really?" And I was like, "She was like, yeah, but but in fairness, I watched it at like two in the afternoon." With my like baby crawling around on a mat in front of me on the floor, so occasionally having to like pick him up and play with him and cuddle him and stuff, and I was like, well, yeah, that's why it wasn't scary, because you were not focused 100% on the screen in a dark room at night. Whereas I think part of the problem is again, you know, it's it's well, 20 past one here in the afternoon. It's a well, it's a cloudy, horrible day outside. It's not actually that nice, but. <laughs> But a lot of the scare factor of a game like this kind of falls away if you're streaming because it's like having someone in the room with you. Whereas, God knows, there are some games that I just struggle terribly to play because it's too scary. Like <laughs> Slender. I, I hate playing Slender um, because I get genuinely terrified by it. Should I? <laughs> that some The other aspect is actually one thing that annoys me is uh, unlike JB's setup where he's got it all obviously set up in the same sort of area. Um, and you can just sit and play away at a desk. I've got um, a slightly different setup here. So my Xbox is through in the other room and there's no camera and there's nothing like that and no PC. So I would literally have to sit a laptop so that I could see the chat. That's one that I think one aspect of these sort of things that they never they haven't quite ironed out is a good way to put the chat up on screen. Alright, that window is there for one reason and one reason alone, which is to presumably Oh it doesn't work. I have to do another thing. So that's there to me let me see something walk past. Yeah, I love horror films and horror games as well. I absolutely love them. I've always been a big fan. In fact, it annoys the hell at me that a lot of pals of mine just refuse to play these games and refuse to watch horror movies. Um, I mean, it's their prerogative. That'll be the arc then. Yeah, it's to totally their prerogative to do that, but or to not do that, as the case may be. But it means it's really irritating. It's like um, Stephen King's It's just come out of the cinema. Can I find someone to go and see that with? No. Like, nobody wants to go and see it. If any of my pals are watching this, watch more horror films. Sorry for any of you want to go take a chance. Yeah, basically, yeah, it's, everyone seems to want to kill themselves afterwards, so let's not do that. Would I kill myself if I scanned myself into this? No, because I wouldn't care, because it wouldn't be me. It would be uh, a copy of me, and that version of me would be quite happily living in his continued existence, but it wouldn't be me, and I don't believe I would suddenly take on that consciousness at the moment of unexpected death, because how would that work? Because if that was the case, then you're meant to, like, Buddhist, you know, kind of concepts of reincarnation and stuff. Right, do that, seal that, ask permission, brief everyone, take it to Omicron, pick up the suits, write the claim to this, read the tow, head to the launch site, look for the launch up. I'm going to have to do the last couple of steps. Huh? Wait, this isn't... Oh, no! Wow got to the Dunbat before we did, am I right? Well, it was talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it. The Dunbat was our best shot. I was really banking on this Slender is scary. Come on, we can't quit now. There's got to be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the Ark down the Abyss in the first place? 
If they didn't use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the climber at Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the abyss. Okay, so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah. Okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. <laughs> that does sound useful. I'm a robot. All right, let's go then. I don't need the power suit. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the arc here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get Maybe on we the arc. ourselves straight into it. Maybe this is the arc. This is real. You didn't know how to get us on? How difficult could it be? That's a stupid thing to say. Start an arc simulation. I want to see how it works. I want to start an arc simulation. Someone's going to come and try and get me. Ugh. Oh. Tell a woman. It caused so many bad. Oh, can I, can I leave now? Well, no, not yet. <laughs> it's so close. It's so close. It's so far away. Yeah, Slender's, Slender's a funny game. Um, in the sense that, oh, funny. What's this thing? That's just a compound examiner. Coster uses it to investigate structural integrity in payload frameworks. Of course. Could you fit inside it? If I knew what you were made of, it would be a hell of a lot easier to figure out how to get you on the Ark. Step into the giant exploding machine. It looks like a terrible place to be. Oh, is that coordinates? Good to know. I'm doing this now because I guarantee once I get in there, it's all going to go Wow, hard. that's so cool. It's the whole gang. A crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. Now I know better. That's Phi, all right. Quick stop at Omicron, then Tau, then Phi. Let's do it. Let's do it. Safety man. Always check the safety manual. Oh, it'd be nice if there was something written on the back. It's just like, you know, eat at Joe's. Okay. Yeah, sorry, I was just saying, um, Slender, Slender has an interesting place in the, in the history of, um, of game streaming, because Slender, if you think about it, was kind of the, apart from, like, crappy Call of Duty videos and stuff like that, and people recording Halo and things, Slender was kind of the birthplace of live streaming. In a lot of ways. I mean, it really, I mean, that was the game that made, like, PewDiePie and people like that. Because, I mean, I know myself, I never watched. Yes, I am covering my beard. I never actually watched um, any streams before that point because basically it didn't interest me. I'd rather, I'd rather play a game than watch a game. Slender came out and I was terrified playing Slender. But I was seeing a girl at the time and she was really into horror movies and stuff and she basically love to sit and watch PewDiePie, who I'd never even heard of at the time. And yeah, we ended up watching streams of that and Amnesia and it, it kind of went from there. And that was kind of the same, the whole sort of the whole of YouTube across. And it ended up becoming a massive thing of sitting and watching people play scary games and get, you know, because people like watching people going, ah, like that every now and again. So yeah, I mean, uh, what's funny about Slender is there's other games that have come out since then. It's actually got there was a game there was a game that came out, and I'll love you forever if you know the name of this one. If you don't, don't worry about it because I've tried googling and can't find it. There was a game that came out mm, maybe three four months after Slender, and it was another little kind of Unity project somebody made, and it was a similar kind of thing. It was a black and white game where you walked around. It was almost like a it was like a maze, but not quite a maze. It looked almost like a sauna or something like that. It was just kind of this slightly weird environment where it was like square rooms which might have a door on every like the first room you're in is just a square room with one door so you'd walk out that door into the next room but there was no door and as you turn around the door behind you was no longer there and you would have to turn until the door appeared and it, 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 as soon as you it was the same principle as slender as if you look away from the guy he becomes closer but in this one if you looked away from the door it wasn't there anymore and as the game went through the static got like more and more um, prevalent to the point where at the very very end of the game you can practically see nothing and then eventually a face just goes like, like you. it was really cool 
I cannot find it for the life of me now. Can't find it online, can't find any reference to it, can't find the name of it. It really, really annoys me. Because I really wanted to play that again. I was quite fast. And all I can unfortunately, you try searching horror and static. There, there is a horror game that's called that, which I may see later. Bit of a tight fit. Can you reach the on switch? Motion second. Should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that going to work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um, I think they're bigger. You should be able to wear them both. Imaging? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocute torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. Hey, don't say that. She was my... She was nice to me. Anyway, the Cortex chip is good news. That means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we've run into? Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best in both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. Oh god, that reminds me of my eyeballs. It was horrible dream last night. At least we know how to get on the ground. Sort of. I understand the concept, but I don't know the yeah. specifics. David, I, I really David wish we could figure out how the scan data is formulated in process. Like, flattened? Oh god, it was horrible. I mean, he wasn't horrible, but it was just weird. It was such a strange dream, and I was having a conversation, and he was like an old mate. It was David Wenham, it looked like David Wenham. But he was like an old mate of mine, and it happened to him at some point. That's weird. Yeah, talk about your dreams because everybody finds that interesting. Am well, Amnesia is one of my favourite games of all time. Hence, I'm playing Soma, same game by the new game by the same people. Um, uh, Machine for Pigs was okay. I mean, it's not not as good as the original Amnesia by a long stretch, but it's a slightly more interesting narrative. Um, Containment Breach. That's the one that's like SCP. I can't remember the numbers of them now. Um, it's the, basically the similar idea to Slender. It's like as soon as you look away, the thing comes close. You know, the thing, the thing that was clearly what Stephen Moffat ripped off to make the Weeping Angels in. Get an arc simulation going. Clearly, the thing that um, yeah, he nicked, he nicked that idea to do the Weeping Angels in. Uh, How? Connected. I have to find a pipe and plug it in somewhere. This whole, uh, this whole game is plugging and unplugging pipes from things. We've reduced science down to literally putting a plug in. Yeah, there's a couple of different SCP games. Um, obviously, the, the main one I think is Containment Breach, which is the one we're using. There's been umpteen different iterations of it, but you're basically one of three or four, um, what are they call, called Delta classes or whatever they're called? Basically guys on life sentences, uh, and you go in and the big funny shaped thing facing the walls there, and then it kills everybody else, and then you've got to get out the door, and then you've got to escape that, and pretty much everything else from SCP as you get through. No, I want everything. Right, what can we get rid of? A lot. Well, I want all the physics, because it's stupid not to have the physics. What can we do without? What's the biggest thing here? The river and the cabin exterior. Do that a bolt. Do that a river. 
package. Let's just take everything out, and then work from there. Right. Light. Fluid physics. Okay, you know what? No, I'm having, I'm having this lot. We don't need any heat. We don't need any fluid. Find a moon, why do I need to? We, okay, we need an environment. Cabin and a chair. Uh, sun, yeah, and a heat. Water of some kind. Up the lake. Can't have. All right, you know what? Okay, well, let's do it at daytime. Let's get rid of the river. Um, this. Okay, let's start by getting rid of the big things. Well, I'm not at EGX this week, so I might stream some stuff over the weekend, although I am away on Saturday, because there's uh, like a beer festival on. No, no, that's next weekend. some form of water. Basically, I need an environment of some kind, some kind. Otherwise, it just doesn't work. God, we're only thirty or forty off. No, I need daylight. Boy, physics buoyancy. I can get rid of the leak. Oh, 
Oh, Johnny's streaming all day today. Um, yeah, this is his big stream day. In fact, it's not his family. It's Dougie. It's Dougie Santa. I don't know Dougie. Or I might know Dougie. I'm very bad with people's first names. I'm very bad. Especially when I only know them as a stream name. This weekend, yeah, as I said, I mean, well, today's Friday. Tomorrow evening, I'm out. I might do a stream tomorrow during the day. Um, actually, Johnny's not going to be EJ, so we might stream some. Okay, first required. Sim. I saw my type map. Right, so. First thing needed. Vegetation. It's got to be advanced vegetation. That need the interface. Need some form of light. Nope. Alright, some form of light. Now if it's daylight, that requires heat. Try loading a dummy scan. Shouldn't be that difficult. I just want to make sure I understand how the scan data is formulated oh, no. before we start messing around with the real arc. Run the simulation and then hit pause while again. the code is running. It'll give me a cross section of the process. Oh, I wish I'd known that. Oh. Yeah, well, the thing is, I mean, you know, Johnny might not stream on Saturday, probably because he does have, you know, kids and a uh, young wife, and... Why do people say that? Why do people say, oh, he has a young wife? It's like, because, like, an old wife's not going to require any attention. Um, but no, he's got to do family things, because that's nice. But, yeah. Pause while the dummy is loaded, otherwise I can't know if it's working or not. You need to catch it while it's being loaded. No, try again. The dummy needs to be loaded when you pause. Try pausing it when the dummy oh, is loaded. Oh, shut up, woman. I know what I'm supposed to be... Oh, oh, I see. Yes, of course. So precise, so perfect. Nothing like admiring your own work. What? Oh, right. Are we done here? Can we go to Omicron and get my new suit now? Yeah, we should get going. Want to bring this arc as a backup? No, that wouldn't work. This is just a prototype. Good. I prefer to travel light. Let's go. Don't forget to take me with you. Well, I can't get to the door without you, so that would be difficult. Yeah, like I said, uh, no, I think I'm actually not busy until tomorrow night, so I might try and stream something during the day. It might not be this. I, I do actually quite fancy. Um, there's a game called The Long Dark, which uh, I streamed a little of a while ago. I don't think I saved the stream. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I can't remember. Um, it's really good fun. Uh, it's a survival kind of... Uh, well, uh, post-apocalyptic, uh, where the apocalypse is a... Uh, what do you call it? Electromagnetic disaster. So all the electrics in the world don't work anymore and you're literally, your plane has crash landed um, in it's either Alaska or just, or kind of in somewhere just on the edge of Canada and the Arctic. 
the Arctics. The North one, or is that the Antarctic? Joke with me. Anyway, uh, so you, yeah, basically you end up crashed there, and you have to build fires to keep warm. You have to find clothes, um, and you've got to do other cool stuff. It is fun. I do enjoy. Uh, and they just released the single player campaign for it, and the single player campaign is just as hard. I like it, it's a big circle, so I can somehow chase me around in a circle. This is the only problem, is I used to I used to do a lot of games journalism. And I've been literally gaming since ever. So as a result, I have what I like to think of, you know, a capable understanding of games design. If not perhaps a slightly over analytical understanding of games design. Well, we don't need to worry about him. Apart from the fact that we should probably just erase him. Yep. Oh my god, I think I've figured it out. Not that there's a lot to figure out in these games. Stop doing that. Um. Okay, oh, games journalism is fascinating stuff. Really, really good fun. I'm taking your splodge. Uh, maybe I'm absorbing all these people. That would be so cool. Basically, how this is going to work is that I absorb everyone else. Oh, that's so not good. That's so not good. Yep. I think it's one of the death ones, though, so... Some of that is not the best shadow. to get to the shuttle. And end up like shanking at us? No way. Listen, I'll create a distraction and pull them to me. Get the gang to the shuttle station. Wait, Brandon, what are you doing? Don't worry, Alice. I'll look back as soon as you guys are safe. Just load up the shuttle and we'll be ready to go. Are you sure about this? I don't plan to die today, sir. See you at the shuttle.
Yeah. Well, uh, you're not sure when Johnny's streaming again. Um, not sure either. Uh, yeah, he's not back up yet. Although I'm never entirely sure. It's it's kind of the weird aspect of this is I don't entirely. Yeah. Um, not sure. I mean, I'm not going to be streaming for forever. I've already been on for an hour and a half. I normally don't stream for more than 90 minutes to two hours just because it's a little short attention span. And then also because I feel like if I upload a video that's longer than that, it's going to get boring. I mean, when was the last time we saw a video of a stream online that was more than like an hour 55? Um, oh, he'll be, he'll be back up soon. I take it he's not watching this. Just lurking in the background like a horrible monster. Anyway, who knows? Is OBS still working? I should probably just trust that OBS is running and stop actually checking it, but the levels, it's good to check the levels. Maybe I need a third monitor to do that. Well, let's go on. Sure that opening doors is not helping. Well, it followed me. It's probably gone off in this direction. Oh, they were there. I don't mean. Oh, I'm actually having time to read this now. Conrad's dead, all the spring of the pump. Worst case of scene, all the pieces of service. Ugh! That's where I came from. I mean, part of this is just get out, I presume. Yeah, he did say that, but I think he said also he was going to have a break a bit earlier. Clearly. I'm to... Ah. Well, that's where I'm going to go next. Oh, this is what's happened to everyone. Yeah, I want to go to the Sarlacc pit. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, the problem with this is I have no idea what's useful information and what isn't, because the game... Nothing of use in here, but something. I hate the idea that I might have missed something. But I also don't want to wander through it. Accidentally. Aha! Sarah, how the hell are we going to make sure the Ark makes it? Every launch is a crapshoot, you know that. I just wish these numbers looked better. What do you care? It's just a pack of data, right? Yeah, just a pack of data. All of humanity on board. Okay, I don't know. something clambering about in the air ducts. I love that kind of stuff. We're just going to add that in. Shit's okay. Hey, way out. Oh. Unless I've gone around a circle and we're back somewhere much earlier in the game. I'm confused. Through 
that. Okay. That would be a classic jump scare opportunity there. If this is a dead end. Where the hell am I supposed to go? I thought this would be it for sure. Oh wait. Yeah, I haven't been through here. No, I have been through here. Probably not the best move for doing that. Ah, no, I'm on the other side of that door. That's fine. So it's, it's just another... That's that door I was looking at right at the beginning that I didn't bother going through. Of course, the stairs. Looks like a part is missing. Probably should have checked that earlier. Strumar! Brand, where are you? It got out of hand. I'm in sector RD4. Did you get everyone downstairs? Yeah, we're safe right now. But you need to get moving. They're gonna figure out where we are and come for us. Don't worry about it. The stairs are blocked and I killed the elevator. Pull the connector chip from the lock. Fine. That means you're stuck as well. Only way to keep you guys safe. Take the shuttle, go to Omicron. God damn it, Juan. You just had to be the hero, you bastard. Good luck, sir. Bastard. Tell Alice I love her. All right, so clearly follow the blood trail. Okay, I know what I've got to do now. Find something nice and heavy to put through that window. And then run away. Because something's going to get angry. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, crap. Oh, God, this is a dead end, isn't it? Hanging out just as well. Wait until he gets bored and walks away. Static's actually quite helpful in this, it's um, a little better than in uh, the kind of wibbly woo. Okay, now he's going to come get me. Oh well. Right, 
Okay, so we could take a run for it. Lead him around in a circle. Don't want to. Sorry about before, Brandon. I'm sorry we couldn't let you rest in peace. Don't touch his scratch. Oh, cool. You won't get me, motherfuckers! You hear me? I killed myself. Missing something. Face is missing something. Oh, you're sure. Sorry, mate. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh, crap. Oh, well done. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm dead. Oh well. That's probably good enough time to stop. That's been an hour and forty-five minutes. And I did the stupid thing and I died. Which generally means I'm getting slightly distracted. So yeah, that's um Yes. That's been another stream of Soma. So that was Soma Stream 4. It's, it's probably not a huge game this. I mean I feel like I'm yeah, I've been through for a bit. No, no problem, Vicky. Um thanks for coming and hanging out. Uh so I'll, I'll more than likely actually bump into you uh, on one of JB's streams. Uh, yeah. So, thanks for that. And I, I'm going to get some lunch because I've not actually had any yet. So, cheers. Until the